And now we move to Portsmouth, where there have been at least five FBI raids, all to stop drugs from coming into our area. And now several indictments and a criminal street gang are in the spotlight for this. Now, the raids in Portsmouth happened on Dale Drive, Maple Avenue, Portsmouth Boulevard, and Highland Avenue. Our Elise Brown has been tracking the raids all morning long and into the afternoon. So, Elise, what are family members saying now? Hey there, Ashley. Before we get into what family members are saying, I want to let you know right now we're off Portsmouth Boulevard where police were searching this home behind me this morning. Right now they have cleared this location, but across Portsmouth at all of these homes, family members and neighbors are distraught, shaken up as officers search these homes. Broken in doors, tears, and shaken up kids who saw family members taken into custody. I love my daddy and I, I want him to be strong. The FBI and Homeland Security are raiding homes across Portsmouth, handing down multiple indictments related to drugs. We drove around the city and found four streets with homes that were targets of the raids. Dale, Maple, Portsmouth, and Highland. This little eight-year-old home with her parents when one raid took place. They were saying, get up. Get out the bed, put your shoes on. Right after that, she says investigators came in, took her by the hand, and brought her and her sister outside. When we got there, her dad was sitting with officers. He called the children's grandmother on the phone and told her to come help, saying it was an emergency. Do you know what they could be looking for inside there? Uh, I don't know. As we spoke with the grandmother, we could hear law enforcement searching through the home. At the other raid locations, police also search. A few looking through this car at one home. While this grandmother has many questions about what's going on, she's mainly concerned about her grandkids. Hoping that they, that they get some counseling. They, they go through a lot. They've been through a lot. Yeah, your heart goes out to all the kids that had to witness this here today. Now, we just got this indictment a short while ago and are digging through this, and we'll keep you updated throughout the day. Live in Portsmouth, Elise Brown, 13 News Now.